Hi, I'm Doug. This is Doug's Dud Stuff, and today we're redoing the compression test on my John Deere 445. Uh, I just got done uh, cutting the grass, or at least part of the grass. I uh, put about an hour and a half on it at full, um, running the 60-inch mower deck, took out the spark plugs, hooking up the old uh, compression tester here. I don't have my tripod, so you guys are all over the place. I apologize. Um, so we have the right side cylinder uh, hooked up uh, and uh, cylinder one on this side. Uh, I was getting originally, when I first got the tractor, 90 PSI. I did a valve job on it, got it up to like 140. Here's to hoping running that new valve job in the spark plugs, by the way. They look great, nice and clean, not oily at all after that valve job. So, uh, do this, we put it in wide open throttle and spark plugs out and here we go. I don't know if we're gonna be able to see this. Oh yeah, here we go, crank, crank, crank. Gotta put on the brake. Brake engaged, here we go. All right, so uh, look at that, 140 still. I hit the, stop, the pause button, sorry, the stop button. 140 is on the low side. Uh, it's supposed to be holding about 170 minimum. We're going to give this another go. All right, uh, here we go. Hmm. All right, well, that's uh, the right side. Let's hook up the left side. All right, we got cylinder two hooked up and... This one's going to be harder to see. Got a little glare. All right, here we go. Cylinder two. Uh, keep on cranking. That's coming up real slow. Huh. Yep, 140. That side didn't come up as quick as cylinder one. I think, you know, I'm going to use it through, this, through the summer. Uh, and uh, we're going to, I think we need a ring job on this bad boy. Anyway, that's the update.